Hey, it's Joe. So I've got another um, uh, video here for you. This one is about another web page, uh, and, and I've been taking you through in these last few videos, I've been taking you through some of the different web pages we've got. We've got a lot of different things that we do. I'm giving you just the highlights so that you can see some of the different things that we uh, and how we put them together. Uh, each one of these is a different site. Uh, this is not one big catch all website that does all these different things. Each one of these is a specific different site with its own specific autoresponder follow up process with its own specific opt-in page to bring people into your list. So you build your list so you, and, and, ways to, to, and we have ways to, to market each one of these websites that you can bring people into it. Uh, if you paid a copywriter uh, to write just one of these pages and they were smart enough to understand how real estate investing works, the different structures they can use, how to put it all together, and they were a professional copywriter that are wor that's working uh, on the same level that I am, uh, you would pay them ten or twenty thousand dollars just for one of these pages. These are all included. Uh, all of these different pages that I've been talking about with you are all included in uh, the mentor program in the push button method. This next one I'm going to talk to you about, uh, and, and I haven't been showing you all the websites because they are proprietary. Uh, we use them specifically for my mentor programs uh, and for my mentor students. We, I don't give this out to a whole lot of people. I don't want to water it down. Uh, it, I keep a fairly small group. You know, when, I, when, when my group gets too big where I can't handle everybody myself personally, where I can't talk to everyone myself, uh, then what I do is raise the price of the mentor program and it reduces again the amount of people that I'm working with. That way I can always keep control of what's going on. I'll just raise my price to, to get fewer people uh, and still have the same or greater revenue, uh, which makes sense for me. Uh, so anyway, this next website is the, the for rent. Uh, the, uh, it's, it's the buyer website. Now we've talked to you about the for rent seller website. We've talked to you about the investor website. We've talked to you about the you know desperate uh, uh, seller website. We've talked to you about the for sale by owner subject to website. Uh, all of those different things in, in previous videos. This one is just for buyers who are who need to buy rent to buy. And we use all the techniques, you know, whether it's the signs, whether it's Craigslist, whether it's fillmyproperty.com, whether it's the for, for sale by owner uh, websites, all the different free ways that, or, or very inexpensive ways to bring leads into our process. And uh, when they come to this site, it, it, the, the offer that we're making on this site is to get a free list of homes that are available rent to buy and it educates them about the process. And again, on this site, it has an audio of me talking about the rent to buy process and what it is, how it works, why it's a benefit to the seller and gets them excited about the process and gets them to, to want to see what we have available and tells them what they need, tells them what they, you know, they don't need to qualify, tells them they don't need a lot of money to make it work and that they can actually own their own property for their family, no matter what their credit looks like. When we can make this work for them. So those are the things that are on the website in an audio form, in text form, and then again, there's an opt-in form for them to fill out if they're interested in the list of properties that you've got. Now, once once they fill out that form, it goes, it puts them into the database, the autoresponder, and that autoresponder automatically sends them out an email that has the, your website with your list of properties, which is another thing that is included in my program, and I'll show you, uh, talk about that on a different uh, uh, video. But uh, um, it shows them all the, the things that you've got available, rent to buy, you know, your investment properties, all that stuff. And it talks to them about what they need to do to buy that property and how to get into that property and all that stuff. Uh, you can then either call those people directly and you can qualify them and find out if they've got money because they're going to tell you they've got money on the website. Most of them that tell you they do actually do have money. Some of them don't. Uh, and uh, you, you get them qualified and you help them get into one of your properties. It's easier to sell a property that you already have than to find a property for a buyer uh, that they want. So focus on selling properties that you already have and finding more of those properties. Getting the buyers for those properties is not difficult. Uh, when we started, when I first started this, uh, finding the buyers was the easy part. It was really simple, and I thought finding the sellers was more difficult. But then we started implementing these other strategies, like the for rent method and the, the, this, this FISBO sec, this, uh, process, all these other things that we now do to find sellers. It makes the sellers easier, and it makes the buyers seem more difficult, even though 
they're not more difficult. They're, <laughs> they're, they're just as easy as they've always been. We can fill a property usually within days of the time that we get it uh, and always within a month assuming that it's an appropriate deal, assuming that the price makes sense. If it's too far overpriced or the property is not right, uh, then we're not going to get it sold. The deal has to make sense no matter how big your list. I think I mentioned this before when I was talking about list building. The deal has to be right. Uh, otherwise, you're not going to sell it. So you have to learn how to put these deals together properly. But once you do, you want to be able to automate this process. And when you have buyers coming, they can either call you and leave a message on your voicemail, and you have to have either call them back yourself, or you have to have somebody call them back, or you have to have somebody gather that information off your website and, and email them something, and you have to pay somebody to do that. Or you can have it automated for you and use a website like this that captures their information, puts them into an autoresponder, automatically sends them an email, gives them information on where to go, how to buy, all those things that they need to do and makes that happen for you. It automates the process for you. And that's the goal uh, with everything that I do. Uh, you know, I, I, I call my method the push button method for a reason. I want to push a button and I want everything to happen for me. I want to talk to as few people as possible. I want to know that when I'm talking to those people, it's high value time that I'm spending, uh, that I'm going to make money uh, and, and I've got you know an idea of how much money I want to make per hour, but even uh, you know even for, for folks who only want to make a hundred or five hundred dollars an hour, uh, these techniques will help you get there pretty quickly. Where you can uh, you know I'll, I'll have people the, the first deal they do this well how much did you make well I made four thousand dollars on that deal it says maybe it wasn't quite as much as I, I could have made I was, okay how many hours did you put into that well I had uh, you know maybe four hours in the deal. It didn't really take me long. Now, you, now, granted, they took time learning the process. They took time you know, setting up their infrastructure. They took time doing those things. But the actual time they had in the deal was maybe only four hours. So they ended up making uh, $2,000, or, or, or I'm sorry, $500. Um, I'm doing my math wrong here. If they, did, if they made $4,000 and, and they put four hours into it, they may end up making $1,000 an hour. If it took them twice that long, they only made $500 an hour. If it took them you know, four times that long, then they made $250 an hour. They're still making a huge amount of money for the amount of time that they're putting in. So it makes it possible for you to automate this process, create a pipeline, educate your buyers and sellers, keep them coming in all the time using cheap outsourced labor uh, who's, who does that work for you so that when you do your job, uh, the job that, that I'm training you to do through this mentor program, through this push-button method, you will be able to make a lot of money during that time. And that's the, that's the whole goal of having your own business. It's having other resources make money for you and having control of those resources so it does that. So this buyer list, and I've got people that have built uh, buyers lists of thousands and thousands of people that they send out their emails to. You know, whenever they get a new property, they'll just send out a blast email to that list and say, I've got a new property. You better hurry because I've, I've got 2,000 people looking at it or even the people that have you know, 100 people. I've got 100 people looking at this. It still sounds like a lot of people. And by the way, it doesn't take long to build 100 people on your list. You can do that in a, in a couple of weeks. So building a, a few thousand doesn't take long either. Mine's, uh, I've got mostly investors on mine, 60,000 strong. You know, so you can, you can build these lists uh, and you can make a lot of money out of it. Your lists are gonna be worth a lot to you. These websites will help you uh, create uh, the kind of business that you want that's gonna give you the lifestyle that you want. Uh, to be successful in this business. All right, hope that helps.